Red team, we've got an important mission today. As you know, uh, blue team seem to have seized Pluto Station. Alex and Bash gave a bit of a run around last week. Uh, however, this time, I want to take it back in force. So we're going to spend about an hour or so plotting and planning and also getting our defenses ready. And then we're going to launch a bit of a strike over there to see about getting it back, all right? Understood. Mr. Collier, I know your ship's operational, isn't it? Yes. And the one myself and the others are building is almost operational. Um, I think we're going to work on another one of your defense satellites today. Maybe if all of us can get that built. I just feel like having two around the base would be a good idea and making sure the okay. base is fully secure. That way, when we do go away and leave it, it's happy. So I think all of us today are going to work on defenses around the base and getting different weapon solutions set up, all right? Understood. Um, one of these satellites is currently at Cavido. That's what I'm thinking. Let's um, build, in that case, let's build another two here. Um, and understood. just have them yeah. ready and standing by. Like, we've got enough magnesium for ammunition and we've not got enough components to build stuff. So let's just get that running, all right? I'll get the blueprint set up now. Fantastic. Uh, what we'll probably do is we'll probably task a couple of people to build that blueprint up. Whereas then I'll let you free to put some other weapons around the base and such. Because I know you've got a few ideas for how we should defend this with like new missile installations and big turrets and things like that. Okay. Cool. Uh, contacting Mr. TC and Mr. Finn. Hello. How's it going oh. over there with the uh, new build? Yeah, we're getting, uh, making quick progress through the component blueprint part so once that's finished it should just be an easy case of uh, running the armor over it and then we'll be good to launch oh sounds fantastic i like that idea awesome uh keep us on that one in the meantime my team we're dismissed let's get to work um boss i do have a question we'll go for it we have more small grid blueprints here than i have red blood cells Yes, we need to get rid of some of those, um, like the small ships. These will get shredded in a matter of seconds. Yeah, Mr. Castle, I've got a job for you. <laughs> oh, no. It involves salvaging. <laughs> oh, Well, okay. let's identify what ships we can use, I think. But, like... Yeah, yeah. We, we've got... Um, we're about to have three Corvettes. I don't think we've, we've actually got the personnel to also utilise combat... These, like, small grid combat ships as well. Ash, you've got one half-built ship on a projector outside and one in a printer. Which one do you want? Bin, bin, bin the one outside. All right, Castle. Your first victim is outside here on a connect or on like a rotor uh, and a thing like that. You're fine. I'm sitting next to it for a minute when you come around. There you go. Scrap this down fully. In one. Yeah, scrap this. Is that ball. ship name say McCann? What? Run, 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 run while you can. Sorry, Can't I, catch I, me. I'm Madeline McCann. <laughs> yeah, Captain, fully step out and first try and store its components. All right. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I, I, I got tired of the interior of it. It took too long to bloody world up. Uh, JJ, is this one also to be scrapped for Red Fighter? Yes, it can. It was haphazardly thrown together, and now that I'm working on the Herald, I do not really need this little piece of junk. That's fine. Mr. Castle, you've also got one next to it called Scrap Me. We'll leave that one for you as well. I'll, I'll let you oversee the salvage division today, as is your god given right. Hail salvage. God given, Hail. boys. Don't you forget it. Uh, what about the box gun down here? Is this yours, TC? Ooh. Yeah, the uh, the Brit. Yeah, do you still want that or not? And uh, negative, that can be uh, repurposed. All right, do you want to go put it next to the castle scrap pile out front? Uh, to be a long commute, so if uh, Castle wants yeah, to. Oh, yeah, I'm on it. I'm on it. <laughs> Ooh! Uh, all right. Just don't. I mean... <laughs> Uh, Mr. Collier, can you get that yeah. blueprint operational for the um, weapons defense uh, squid, please? Doing it right now. Uh, uh, awesome. Yeah, I'm we all right for resources today. to finish this. What the fuck? It, why is that? We should. Don't, don't fly that into. The, why is this being magnetized to go in here? What is? What the, what the? What is this miner doing? Magnus. What's going over that way now? I don't know what's going, but it's doing. We got all our production set last time. Uh, then um, <laughs> there was a resource delivery. It's engines a lot. Oh, brought all this. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, Roger, yeah, that's true. Good point. My bad. I'm, I'm not particularly sure what this is welding to be honest with you, Jack, but it's welding something. It just keeps like flickering to be welded. Oh, fair enough. Your cast is having fun. Um, how do we get? How far do we get on assembling uh, my herald last time, crew? Yours was pretty yeah, done. Almost done, yeah. What did we, yeah. Alex? Do you remember what we needed to do? And I can't remember. 
Uh, I think we needed to paint it. Oh yes, okay. Well, we can just connect in a second. Paint, uh, double check. Um, well, rename one of your car containers for, or two of them for ammo, so that yep. if he pulls ammo for you. Uh, and double check all your heavy armor has actual metal grids in it. And good. Uh, TC, did you say something about our um, inventory and supplies? Or was that on the uh, I, I, station? That was over here on Kadiro, just checking with uh, just checking with Finn. Oh, that works. How are you guys doing over there, Mr. Finn? Have you got everything you need? Yeah, we should have everything. I, th I believe Collier recently did a drop-off for us, and we've got our production systems in place, so we should be able to basically cover anything we need. Sounds good to me. A uh, question to the people at the base. Hello, yes. Is there anything here with a landing gear that's capable of moving a craft? Uh, Depending on the size of the craft, we can just... Uh... Put a landing gear on something. Yes, what's the what's least useful? Uh, like, what isn't going to be missed for the next 10 minutes? Uh, I put the orange grinder ship next to Mr. Castle, but it seems like he's going at it manually, so. He's, he's a man of culture. <laughs> He'll enjoy a bit of a manual. Yeah. So take that orange one out here on the landing bay. Splendid, thank you. It's coming with me. Chip. Uh, okay. Problem solved. If you want extended, aka longer episodes, as well as early access to new Space Engineers Outpost Wars videos, then consider becoming a YouTube member today. Your support means the world to all of us. Clearly smart. Shit name. What should I call mine? I thought you said shit name. Yeah, I need a shit name. <laughs> Lover of not. I've discovered the issue. Uh, the, qu the Queen's Nuts Revenge. Revengeance. You can just call it Revengeance. Wax. Revengeance. <laughs> uh, okay, well, hang on, hang on. It, it, Herald. What, what is a herald? It's a bird, isn't it? It's a ter- well, yeah, it's also like it's a royalty heard. term, I guess. Oh, you just say me a shit a term now. to usher something in, I thought. Someone herald. who screeches. Definition. Are we An moving? Official employee to oversee moving? state ceremonial presidents, use of arm, arm, armorial bearings. The RWI armorial. I just spell that. Uh, C O R R E C T O Y. One person at a time. Uh, Go ahead, well, Um, it's, it's phonetic. A R O R M O R E L I R A L. What's your spelling of it? Oh, mine was Uh, C O R R E. C O double R E C T O Y. Yeah, oh, it, it spells oh, correctly. It's, it's it's a funny yeah, hard. Spelling but... correctly. It if you're looking for a ship name, why not go with why not go with Viscount? It's a royal. It's a position of government power. Oh, and, it it yeah. and piss it up the wall. Yeah. And a piece of biscuit. Oh shit! Sorry, bow bike. Just fucking wipe the metal bike. Um, I again. fucking hate you for that. You I'm praising gently. I'm going through my like ship name suggestions, and um, I've already forgot what I was going to say. Never mind. Oh, the USS Sandra came up, and I was like, oh, no, no, the USS Karen. The um, US, oh, oh, there's there's a UNSC ship USS name. USS McDonald's. Oh, um, no, it's the UNSC. You know my name. That's a good one. You know perfect, my it's a name. Perfect name for a ship. Oh yeah, Jack, we were talking about that, weren't we? Because I remember us talking about how some of the ships have got the most like obscure names in the world. But they're funny as hell. A lot of the UNSC ship names are quite good, to be fair. Yeah. yeah. Ben, did waiting for this med bay I'm work? waiting for Collier to suggest the RWI walkie slush. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was trying to be serious because I care about ship names, but that is quite funny. The UNSC, a wink in a gin. That <laughs> <laughs> was a wink and a grin, but a gin sounds funny as well. That's US gin muggy. Oh, gin palace. Uh, you were saying something about uh, bed B? Yeah. Well, we got O2 and H2 working. I'm going to call it the absolute. I believe so. Nice. I'm trying to find somewhere to top me to get my bottles topped up because I'm. Uh, no, 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 Jack. Jack, Jack. 
the unit. Use an auto eat an oxygen tank. Ooh. Absolute unit. <laughs> exactly. Absolute fucking unit. Was it fucking laser sight? I'm in awe of this ship. What is it? Fist of family vo uh Fist of uh, family virtue. values. Fist of family <laughs> values. Yeah. Fist of values. Yes. <laughs> If we're, if we're talking Helldiver ship names, the uh, the closest, that, uh, the funniest I managed to get was the uh, the Pledge of Allegiance. No, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the stupidest I've... names I can make on uh, Helldivers. Oh, keep... so good. I keep switching between the Star of Stars and the, the Dream of Dreams. Right, guys, we are, we've had a nap, we've had some food, we're back. Uh, Mr. Serik, you are back at HQ, can you please confirm? Yes, sir, I am back at HQ. Lovely, and the Styx is flight capable? Uh, as far as I know. As far as you know. Right, okay, that, that's filling me with confidence. Um, I've, I've notice... been in the walls for days, <laughs> it should be working. Well, th those of you that are at Main HQ, you will notice that we finally have Time's replacement. Uh, Mr. Fisk has joined nope. us now. Uh, he will Indeed. be replacing Mr. Time. Um, Serik, what I want you to do is gather everyone except Ark uh, together, get the sticks flyable, fly over and drop everybody off, along with some supplies that, that the team that brought Mr. Serik over loaded into the sticks. Um, if you could bring that over yep. to Pluto Station, and then once you get here, drop everybody off, drop off the supplies, um, and then head back to HQ with Mr. Ark, um, and continue working on the resources and repairing the um, the sticks, getting it back up to full functionality. Uh, everybody else... You got the... Go on. You got it, sir. I got it. Okay. That was all. Lovely. Uh, everybody else, we are going to continue working on weapons. Um, so those of you that are at HQ that will be joining us over here, please listen in. Um, those of you that are already here, we're going to be... Myself and Kemps will finish working on the conveyor system, so we'll make sure that everything's up and running and plumbed together. The rest of you, we're basically going to turn this into a giant weapon zone. Uh, lots of very good weapons on the station. We'll deploy some weapons on some of the surrounding asteroids. We are basically going to turn this into a giant war zone that if and when the Reds do decide to come visit, they are immediately going to regret it. Um, yeah. Creative Hoorah. weapons, hidden weapons. Let's do it all. Um, let's, <laughs> let's be nice and creative. Let's find some ways to hide some weapons. Um, let's put some torpedoes down. Obviously, the sticks will bring over some supplies. So, yay, yay, yay. Okay. So Should I find a uh, a cargo port, stock up with conveyor components, and then come find you so we can tear stuff apart and get rebuilding? I lead, lead the way, and I will follow you. Right, I need to find a conveyor port. Uh, so, Tiggs, I had kind of converted or like jerry-rigged our little transport here into a miner. Do you still want me to go get some stuff or? Um, yeah, it, it never hurts to have more, excuse me, more stuff. Currently, we have nothing in the old summary, apparently. Uh, that's whether fun. that's because the, um, the, the program blocks need re, um, calibrating, I don't know. I will check in a moment. I've already lost you, camps. But that's I'm, fine. I've just run upstairs, boss. I'm trying to find somewhere to get some tools from. <laughs> and some right. stuff. Ah! Okay, cool. I'm, I'm not going over there. I'm just running upstairs to try and find something. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, I struggled. There are, there are some basic tools. And I've got, um, I've got basic I've tools. I'm just looking for components. I've, uh, Right, I believe that the supply drop that, that Mr. Fisk is bringing with him does have a bunch of elite tools in it. It has weapons, it has ammo, and it has resources. Oh, I found a cargo so, container, so I've got what I've got what I need. Just going to put the uh, conveyor blocks on my hotbar. 
Lovely. Diablo, oh, I see where you are. I am going to slowly make my way up to you when I can figure out where everything is. I just ran straight up the stairs. Right, I've yep. got loads, loads, of, loads of conveyor stuff ah. on me. Okay, so currently... Um, we there's there's plenty of disconnects in the system because if I check here, um, there are plenty of areas that we can't access at the moment. So hmm. if I check the program block that has, that's helpful. We don't have um, inventory manager loaded up, so I'm going to go ahead and load that. Yeah, it is to be quite helpful. Yep. Loading it up on a program block now. Oh, uh, I'm guessing that these pipes because we're fresh out of the base. Um, like the... three of you all spoke at the same time there, so start again, please. One of you. Doesn't matter who. V6 is confirmed to be flyable, so if everybody can load up, she just turns kind of brickish. Grab a shit ton of resources. Okay, yep. Isis is now up and running. Let's see what errors it pulls up. Uranium couldn't be transferred from small cargo container 15 to large cargo container 3. That's fine. Not worried about that one. Uh, does anyone have the GPS? So it's either this one uh, or the one yeah, above it. it. Yeah, it's it's above this block here. Uh, oh, plus two boxes. Above the one I'm grinding. Uh, no, so you see this locker. Yep. You see the conveyor above it. Right. It's yep. above yep. that. So above it is a sh... Is, uh, that's, yeah, okay. We are setting out. Yeah, I think it's that conveyor port there. It's not quite... That one's showing us full, connected. Hang on. Bring up the heads up. Oh uh, no, it's it's to the left of that conveyor. Sorry, it's to the left of that conveyor. Yeah, it's that conveyor in there. It's not welded up properly. I can see why we have some the station headers and these resource deposits. Okay, that should now be done. So put just put a bump two, in there. Yeah, just bump two conveyors in that space. I had not seen the damage they'd done to our beautiful battleship. My god. Yeah, I'll, when when you guys get over here, I'll do a quick reassess so that I can give you a list of priorities in terms of repairing it, Zarek. Are you meaning, so obviously there's the, the real gun at the front, and then is it the ones directly the side of them? No, 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 no. Uh, engine pods at the rear of the ship. Oh, the engine pods. Right. Yep. So, down the center of the ship. Yeah. In between the engine the cells, at the top and bottom, there are Vulcans. Yeah. What I recommend is grind them down, don't weld them. And then once you've built the armor, because there'll be a conveyor point there, hmm? build an armored conveyor and then put it on top of there so that the that Vulcan's got a better field of view. <laughs> oh, there. Um, did you already get the other one, TT? Uh, there isn't one up here. Oh. There, there'll only be one on the ship because I blocked the other one using a oh, neon this... tube bit. Yeah. That's where it's missing. Yep. Right. Okay, so we'll leave those just now then. So we're, yeah, we're about to build up the project. So the, the yellow projector roll panel, I think, will be on the projector probably. Uh, yeah, that's by that's usually by the door, I think. Okay, let's go get let's go get the bashinator, and uh, I'll go find some ice. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Finn and TC, just let you know. I think on the armor projection, there's like one or two gyroscopes. 
double check for them first before you do the rest of the armor. Right. Why is the Bashanita inside Can of a confirm. rock? confirm, that is like super necessary. What kind of tyrant oh, um, can I? Is the Bashanita inside the asteroid? Question mark? Clear visual um, glitch. Oh, uh, no, is it not the one you were using last time to burrow uh, stuff? Yes, it was. Well, not me personally, but yes, it is. I've just found it. Um, uh, just quickly charge my suit a little bit. But Jack, the, the, the fighter I've been... Ah, fuck it. This fighter I've been slowly working on has somewhat taken more shape. Nice. We tested it? Yes. Yes, this is what I'm trying to finish at the minute. It's now just wording up the last few blocks and making sure the piping works. Oh. Which is... Brr, finicky at best. There we go. So, Finn, how far along is your one coming, your um, Herald class? We are working on the armor at the moment. Hi, right, so again, Evan. Uh, yeah, we hopefully have gotten the gyros. Uh, I think there's one it says that we're missing, so we can find that. Uh, as I said, I, I, what I really recommend is pretty much just, just finding a spot where you can fit one instead of. Yeah, you know, unless it's like an obvious thing. Yeah. Yeah, just. Okay, just so find one it. is stored on here now. Uh, it's not the missing one, but it's an extra one, yes. Awesome, that's fine. That'll do. That'll do. Oh, don't that'll do. Well, that'll do. Uh, I'm going to add more to mine, though, because... Okay, the, basically, for those that are going to be piloting this thing, if you you shouldn't ever be close enough to the enemy where they can put Gatling guns on you, right? If you find yourself that close, you need to be holding space forward and rolling at the same time. So if you can fit more gyroscopes, put more on there, because you want to be able to roll like crazy. Like Crocodile you... having a melee fight. Are you engaging the MCRN's Rosalante spin so you get as max PDC coverage as possible? Oh, 3,000%. That, that is the design yeah, That is the design of this ship. ship. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't know that much, but I'm saying like, it's, have you actually correlated that into Space Engineer's terms? Basically. That is ridiculous. Oh, you guys I mean, pretty good, pretty quick at designing this defense satellite. I think we want different guns in it, not the um, missile ones, whatever way, rocket turrets. Uh, no, this one doesn't have rocket turrets on it. I'm thinking. Yeah, it's got the E1s, isn't it? I don't think we need the B1s. I think we're better off. Oh, no. Hang on, I don't know. These are going to be long range, aren't they? Yeah, no, yeah. yeah. Well, the B1s are only two and a half clicks. It's not. I think that's the longest oh. range. The other one, the only higher range one is the coil cannon, I believe, the magnetic coil cannon. Or missiles. Yeah, but missiles have to be fired by some. Yeah, man yeah, manually. So it's yeah. they they can engage these turrets if we don't see them, is what I'm yeah. trying to say. Can we fit a coil cannon on one of these? Oh, um let's have a look. <laughs> uh not no. It, um <laughs> No, not no that. We it, it breaks the rule of cool drastically if we do try it. Yeah. We could uh, put one on the base somewhere. I think in an ideal world, we need to get at least the station armed up within the next hour. Um, and then we can start working on other things. Just as a, a, as a rough timeline in our country. <laughs> that really big asteroid between the base on top of the base towards the red team's base see if I, I can make some um heavy bunkers there just absolutely fill them with artillery pieces yeah well give us i think a good if, we, heads if up. we break if we how many of us are there at plutus station there are uh hang on Five, let me I do believe. some math in my brain uh one two three four five six there are seven of us um, so if I if I start working on the that's that's in total that's everybody that's going to be here because I'm just not including Ark and Serik and Kor who seems to have wandered off we don't know where he is um, and I'm also not reading him on the uh, on my scanning systems so I no idea where he's got to um, mm. he'll show up eventually um, I heard it's Ark, saying about butterfly Ark, oh god we really need to fix him. Um, I'll start He's working on the defense platforms. If the six remaining, if you break into teams of two, um, 
and one of you one and you you start working on station defenses that would be fantastic so i think if we work in teams of two we can get an effective defense screen set up relatively quickly do you want me to continue mining or work on defenses um i think for the moment lavernius let's worry about defenses with the supplies that we've already got plus what the sticks is bringing over um, we should have enough materials to build an effective defense screen on this station takes um, i need a suggestion about the defense platforms yes Mr. Boss. trying to tuck them inside of the asteroids like there's some natural pod marks on these things if oh no, they were gonna. Those. I was gonna just pop them in space and have them mobile. That works too. I was just trying to think of like the idea of like if you give the turrets a limited range of view, it makes it to where anything that comes within range of it just immediately gets shot at. So. Oh yeah, we'll we'll be doing that as well. So as I said, once we've got an effective um, defense grid around the station itself, and I've got a couple of the weapon platforms up and running. Um, we're then gonna start spreading little platforms out into the various asteroids um, and, and basically just turn this into a very unpleasant time for the red team if and when they decide to come visit. Oh, I hope they come visit. I, I think it's fair to say it's only a matter of time. That was some supplies. I think I found somebody's body. Kemps, did you kill yourself? Um, oh, no. Not voluntarily. It was a lack of oxygen. Lovely. And I looked up at the wrong moment because I've got my projection thing off as well. Uh, uh, um, Sarek, can you turn the projector off on the sticks, please? Uh, yes. Thank you. Because currently I can't look in that general direction because my screen just fills with green blocks. Yep. Thank you. Uh, yeah, Tiggs, I can't do much more building for of turrets until we get the supplies from the sticks because we need nickel, we need a lot of other stuff just to make components. Understood. Commander, this is the sticks. Coming in the dark. Mm. Okay, I will come out and meet you. Did y'all manage to exterminate the rat? Uh, yes, we did. We did. It took some time. Good. And, and I, I think... Teamwork needs right. to be worked on a little bit, but um, <laughs> of course. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's have a look at this sticks. Let's see what needs repairing. Um, what does end. what does? Oh, really? Is that is that still bad? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Um, what's what state is main engineering in, Mister Sirik? Uh, it's not on fire, at least. Well, that's that's good. Yeah, as far as I can tell, time's uh, well, uh, terrifying creation is. Yeah, it's smoking a little, to, but it's all right. You'll need to when you get back to the main base, make sure to dock the sticks up, dismantle that core, because um, then when you turn the projector back on and make sure it's set to build only, um, there yeah. should be a full size reactor. Um, right out on this ship. So just dismantle this reactor and and build the proper one. Yes, sir. Um, I've, but yeah, focus. I've broken down. Focus on the main engineering. Those. Focus on the main engineering systems. Um, get that rear end fixed back up. Get her booty repaired. Yes, sir. Um, and then just basically just get her back up and running. Um, and I will leave it to your to your God help me judgment as to how best to repair her, but focus on the engineering systems and whatnot yeah. first, okay? Whee! I'll fix it, Jack. Yes. <laughs> so do you want to do you want to spin something else around? Of course, thank else for you. Your you can spin something else around to see the gyro power of. Yeah, go look at the the blue, white, and well, the turquoise, grey, and white thing, and just wiggle your mouse. All right.
We, we can all your mouse around, it's quite funny. Do you want to speak okay, to so me? there's got to be uh, another antenna that is set to 25,000 kilometers, because the beacon is set to 500 meters. Check your oh. absolute beacon. The absolute has... Make sure it's absolutely off. Who fucking damaged the, the bastionator, by the way? Like, who crashed oh, into bye. something? Oh! Whoa! Oh, that like oh, someone just got tased. It works. <laughs> Someone just got tased, I swear. Taser, 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 aim for bollocks. Taser, aim, taser, 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 laser points on bollocks. Shit. Laser, Shit. taser, bollocks. Um, fair. M250 yeah. mole miner has a broadcast radius of 50k. Yeah, that sounds like a smart idea, guys. <coughs> Team Asteroid Base has a broadcast radius oh. of 50k. Should we keep fucking idea. around of our stuff? Um... You know how you want to tune up? You know how we want to uh, try some new stuff? Yeah. There's something that's got a function called follow me. Oh, no. What do you. Yeah. yeah. So, um. Uh, We've nearly finished. So, uh. How about we make some follow me? <laughs> Why don't you get to work on some followings and I'll finish up the armor? Roger Wilco. Go ahead, Froggy. Just Can you confirm the signal is gone now? Uh, checking, checking. Roger Wilco, but they shut down. No. No, uh, yep. so. All gone. Nothing. I remember the whole Wilco thing kicked off, and obviously everyone was like, obviously upset people losing their jobs, which is, you know, is a bad thing. The TikTok about it was like, oh, here's Sander, she served 39 years of a checkout department, one of a regiment of a checkout department. Wait, um, Wilco or Woolworths? No, check Wilco. your uh, connectors turned off, I believe? Yeah, no, I turned off. Okay, good. It's because it was public was good. I'm not talking about sleeping here. The oh, fucking yeah, uh, scandal man, like, he only went out of business a week, and then all of a sudden that sheep from the adverts was on a fucking kebab stick. He's an inside job. Wait, Bash, did it you was take the fucking the dog. To mine? Yes. You didn't take one of the big miners. I didn't realize we had big miners, to be honest with you. Uh, do we, do we, not, do we have big miners? jump in the gobbler. Yeah, we've got two. Oh. Big one Sorry. over here where I am. Um, I, I just I tend be to ignore careful. everything. Its thrust is probably not accurate for its weight ratio, but it will do the job. Uh, Jake, do you want some of the cool customizations that Koyo did to his? Um, no, it's fine a bit. We'll leave it as is for the minute. Uh, and then we'll customize it after it's first run out, so. Uh, just, uh, you need two things that I really recommend you do before you do anything else. Uh, is these, uh, Vulcans on the top and bottom, raise them by one block. Okay. Uh, and then also you can fit a antenna flat up here nice. you, you uh without the antenna your targeting distance is going to be significantly reduced okay, <laughs> so okay i'll get to work that. on the uh, copying the antenna design yeah if you want to overlook that i've got something else to deal with it so, so. if you want extended aka longer episodes as well as early access to new space engineers outpost wars videos then consider becoming a youtube member today your support means the world to all of us